In this video, we're going to show you how to replace your rear tailgate left-handed located right here on your Ford Explorer. Twist that, open up the rear hatch. Using your trim tool, we're going to go ahead and carefully remove these series of plastic push buttons across the upper portion of our panel. Go ahead and repeat for the rest of those. Using the paper towel will help protect the trim itself from your tool. Now we're in your hand up alongside here and we're gonna gently pull this panel down We're going to undo these little clips here that are actually holding the panel up into the door. Just below the pull strap here, there's going to be two Phillips head screws. Loosen and remove those. Continue working your way around, pulling the panel off. Right where our lock button is, is a trim piece right here. We're gonna go ahead and use our trim tool here. And just gently get up underneath and pop that off. There is a Phillips head screw just to the left of the lock button. Hold your panel up in place, remove that screw. Then we can gently work that panel down and off. And go ahead and set that aside. Now on the inside panel right here, we're going to find a 7 16 nut right here. You can try and access it through this port right here, maybe with a swivel or something. I'm unable to do so, so I'm going to use a wrench. Now once you get the nut off the other side, go ahead to the other one here and remove this one. And once you have the nuts off, you're going to go ahead and work that handle out. Now there's a metal plate on the back side too. You'll probably hear that drop down inside the door. Go ahead and work this unit out. As we lower our handle down into the tailgate, we have to install our plate. I want to go ahead and install the nuts on the handle studs here. Those two bolts right here holding our bracket for our power window motor. We use our 7 16 gear wrench here. Go ahead and pull that bracket with that motor. Now with that wiper motor bracket loose, I'm able to reach my hand up inside and get that other nut started. Go ahead and start to tighten those down. I just want to tighten down the other side here. Make sure that's nice and snug. I'll go ahead and double check this one here. Let's go ahead and install our bolts for our wiper motor bracket here. 
Now on the back of these here is a rubber grommet with a nut inside of it. So I'm gonna make sure you can catch that. Here. Let's get install our tabs in the door shell. When installing this here, you want to make sure that you have your door lock button through the hole. Push that panel up into place. With these locked in, we can now go ahead and install our Phillips head screw up by the window. All right, tighten that down. Install our little door lock button right here, a little trim piece. Right, install our pull strap. and snug. We're now going to install our six plastic push pins around the upper trim of the door panel. And repeat for the other five. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.